thing is we are using a veterinary specific insulin. So this is a different concentration than human insulin. Okay. So we cannot use human insulin syringes. Okay, that was my question because I can get them at work. <laughs> and the dose is about two and a half times different. Okay. So we do not want to mix them. Um, so they are marked on the syringe based on units. Okay. Obviously 5, 10, 15, 20. So that's how many units. So we're just going to start with one unit. So we're just going to draw it to one little indicator, one mark on here, which is pretty clear to read. But just that first dash, so from zero to one, is all we need to do. That much. So, what I'm going to have you do first is draw up some sterile water. Just want to watch you draw it up, make sure that goes okay. Injections are facing away from me. Are you right handed? Uh -huh. Perfect. So, what I like to do is my left hand, I pinch the skin up and create a little pocket. So, that's my, my aim right there between the two index fingers. You see the little pocket there? Uh -huh. And then we take my right hand with the syringe, we touch against the skin, pop through the skin, and then give it. Don't aspirate. We just want to just go ahead and give it. All right? So, we'll have you go so ahead you want me and give that. So, go ahead and saline. give that, that one unit. Yep. Come here, Miss Case. So right in there. Yep, and so just right into the hold of skin. There you go. Give it, and you're good. All right, if you just want to set that down, I'll take that sharp from you. Perfect. No safety needles here. <laughs> <laughs> now for insulin. So insulin has to stay in the fridge. Right. Prozac, human insulin, or sorry, veterinary insulin. Never shake the bottle. Okay. Very, very fragile molecule, and if we shake it, we'll actually damage it, and it won't be as efficacious anymore. So we have to stir it though before we use it. So you lay it flat in your hand, and we just want to roll it back and forth about 10 seconds. That's how we stir it up without damaging the molecules. Just roll it back and forth. So this stays in the fridge. Whenever you're not using it, so you can get out. So okay. I can't pre-draw it up. I cannot. No. No. Okay. I wish, I'm sorry though. Yeah, yeah, I'm not the only time. Yeah. So we do that and then repeat the process with, with drawing up one unit. How do you do that? And so if I give this to her now, it won't matter that I give it to her again in the morning. In the morning, we'll be fine. Okay. Yeah. So ultimately, we're going to probably go to two, two doses two per doses day. Two doses per day. Mm -hmm. Okay. And again, you don't care if you clean that off nope. first or anything. Wow. Do you want to bring home some alcohol wipes? It makes you feel better. You're definitely yeah. more than welcome to. Do you know they're like, what? How much do they cost? Not that much. So there's, there's one, one unit. unit. Perfect. All right, sister. Get it on. Kind of hard to get that little fold right there. You ready, sister? One, two, three. Mine's not very good aim, but <laughs> pretty good. All right, and I'll show you one more time here when I when I pick up. I actually yeah. use my middle finger and thumb okay. to pinch the skin, and if I don't get a good pocket, then I use my Jeez. index finger to just touch down and then I end up having that little pocket that I want to aim into. This so, piece. so middle finger and thumb. Oh, you're gonna middle finger. With. There you go. Oh. And if you don't get a good pocket, then you can just touch with your index finger and just push down right there just to give okay. yourself that little pocket. And you're just aiming between your finger and thumb at a 45 degree angle down. And don't hit yourself. And please don't give yourself the insulin. <laughs> no. Okay. Sound good? Uh, yeah, no, but. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to do fine with this. Yeah, I'm, I will. I'm